Okay guys, sorry about that. My pool guy is coming to close my pool, so I had to had to kind of talk to him. So we have this next idea, it's called extrapolation. And that's when you use, you try to use a regression line, but you end up making a prediction that's far outside the values, um, the interval of values for the explanatory, um, explanatory variable. So I'm gonna use this example right here, okay? And it has, it has it actually has it right here. It says, for the advertised price and number of miles of data, the equation, the regression line is the same one. Okay, they have this little square here. Please take the time, take the second it takes to write the, the true thing. Okay, it probably just doesn't take that. Predicted price equals 18,773 minus 86.8 times the thousands of miles. So predict the asking price for a car with 50,000 miles. So when you take your take your little calculator, there's two ways that you can do this, okay? I can write my equation in to y equals, see my y equals there, and I can write in 18,000, okay, 773 minus 86.18, uh, where's my x, x, okay? And then just hit enter. And I could go to second trace, which is calc. Value is number one. Um, it says 50,000 miles. I have a plot on here, so I should probably turn that off. So I'm gonna go second y equals, and I'm gonna turn that plot off, because it could, it could affect my data. And then go back to my y equals screen, and then hit second and trace for calc, and one for value, okay? and x equals, and now I'm going to plug in um, 50 for because it's in thousands of miles, and I'm going to hit enter, and it says invalid, okay? So what I didn't do here is the problem that I'm having is my y, e here's my y equals screen, okay? And when I look at my window, my window's not going to be able to handle that. Okay, so I guess I would have to go through and change my window. So let's see what that, see how my, my X max is 41.4 and I tried to put in a 50. That was the problem. So I'm gonna put in zero and I'm gonna go to X max of say 60. Or let's say, who cares, right? Let's clear that. Let's make X max of 250. And my Y's, I don't know, I don't know. Let's make this zero and let's make this 10,000. Now, I don't even know if this is gonna work. Graph, we don't have a graph. There it is, okay? So let's get to my y equals screen. Let's hit second calc trace, value, and then hit 50. And it tells me what the value of that car is. So if the car had 50,000 miles on it, I can use this equation to predict how, it's, how much it's worth. Now, you guys don't have to do this because there are so many sites that do it for you now. There's many sites. It used to be Kelly Blue Book was a big one. Um, but now there's many sites that do that for you, okay? So write that down. We say, what is it? We predict the asking price. We would say the asking price is $14,464, okay? So the next one, it says they want to predict the asking price if it has 250,000 miles. Now, I want to show you that that we can get an answer. We can get an answer for this, okay? I can hit second trace and hit value, and I can plug in 250, and I get an answer, and it says negative 2,772. Does it make sense that a car is worth negative $2,772? No, and that's the example of extrapolation. Why? Because we picked a number that's far outside the interval of values. It doesn't make sense. This would only make sense until you got to a spot where where it was worth zero, where it wasn't worth any money anymore. And I don't even know that the zero part makes sense because a car is usually worth more than zero dollars. You can bring it someplace and salvage it, okay? So um, know that you have a certain window of values that you can use for X. And when you go outside that window, window of values, okay, it's an example of extrapolation, okay? So on the back of that next sheet, you should have a clear sheet, okay? 
and this is where we're picking things up, okay? So again, I'm gonna pause the video really quickly here. I'll be right back, but what I need to do is I need you guys to put this information here, okay? It's extra information. I think it's gonna help us with this section.